Hello, Jackson, Mississippi. We are excited to bring you important information about the upcoming Ward 2 special election. We are here tonight to talk about something incredibly important, your right to vote in the upcoming Ward 2 special election. This election is not just another date on the calendar. It is a pivotal moment for our community. This election is crucial for the residents of Ward 2. It is your chance to influence the future of your neighborhood, to ensure that your concerns and aspirations are heard and addressed. It will determine who represents your voice on the city council. The person elected will be responsible for making decisions that affect everything from local infrastructure to community programs. We're here to break down everything you need to know, from why this election is happening to how you can make sure your vote is counted. Understanding the process is the first step in making an informed decision. This election is an opportunity for the residents of Ward 2 to have their say in how their community is run. It's not just about choosing a representative, it's about shaping the future of our community together. Let's get started. The history of elections in Jackson, Mississippi is rich and storied. Each election has brought about change and progress, reflecting the evolving needs and desires of our community. This special election is no different. It is a continuation of our democratic tradition, a chance to build on the foundations laid by those who came before us. The candidates running in this election have been working tirelessly to earn your vote. They have been engaging with residents, listening to your concerns, and presenting their visions for the future of Ward 2. It is important to take the time to learn about each candidate, their platforms, and their plans for our community. As you prepare to cast your vote, Consider the issues that matter most to you, whether it's education, public safety, economic development, or healthcare, your vote is your voice. It is your opportunity to influence the direction of our community and ensure that your priorities are addressed. Remember, there are multiple ways to vote in this election. You can vote early, vote by mail, or vote in person on election day. Make sure you are registered and know your polling location. Every vote counts, and your participation is crucial to the success of our democratic process. The future of Ward 2 is in your hands. By participating in this special election, you are taking an active role in shaping the community we all call home. Let's come together, make our voices heard, and build a brighter future for Jackson, Mississippi. Thank you for being an engaged and informed voter. Let's make this election count. So why is there a special election in the first place? Well, sometimes unexpected events create vacancies on elected bodies like city councils. In the case of Ward 2, the previous city council member resigned. This resignation means that the residents of Ward 2 need someone new to represent them. That's where the special election comes in. This election is the process by which the voters of Ward 2 will choose their new representative. Clear and simple, right? The big day is coming up soon. Mark your calendars for insert election date here. On this day, residents of Ward 2 will have the chance to cast their votes and make their voices heard. Remember, this election is specifically for residents of Ward 2. Not sure if you live in Ward 2? No problem. We'll provide information on how you can confirm your voting district a little later in the show. Stay tuned. Now, we know that not everyone can make it to the polls on election day. Life can be busy, and sometimes unexpected events come up that make it difficult to get to your polling place. Whether it's work, family commitments, or other responsibilities, we understand that getting to the polls isn't always easy. That's why we have absentee voting. Absentee voting allows you to participate in the election even if you can't be there in person. It's a convenient option for those who may be out of town, have health issues, or simply prefer to vote from the comfort of their own home. This is a safe and secure way to cast your ballot if you can't be there in person. Absentee ballots are handled with the utmost care to ensure that your vote is counted accurately and securely. You can trust that your voice will be heard. The city clerk's office wants to make sure everyone has the opportunity to vote. They are dedicated to providing all the information and assistance you need to make your voting experience as smooth as possible. Whether you have questions about the process or need help with your absentee ballot, they are there to help. They will be open on specific dates and times for you to cast your absentee ballot. It's important to be aware of these dates and plan accordingly. Make sure to mark your calendar and set reminders so you don't miss your chance to vote. Be sure to check the city clerk's website or call their office for those specific dates and times. The website will have all the information you need, including hours of operation, 
locations, and any special instructions. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to reach out to them directly. Your vote is your voice, so make a plan. Voting is one of the most important ways you can participate in our democracy. By making a plan to vote, you're ensuring that your voice is heard and that you have a say in the future of our community. So take the time to prepare, know your options, and make sure your vote counts. Every vote matters, and together, we can make a difference. Section 5. The Importance of Voting. Every voice counts. We can't emphasize this enough. Your vote matters. Every single vote in Ward 2's special election carries weight. This is about your community, your neighborhood, and your future. The decisions made by the City Council impact everything from roads and parks to public safety. When you vote, you're directly shaping these decisions. Don't let this opportunity pass you by. Section 6. Jackson under a state of emergency. Navigating challenges, ensuring fairness. As many of you know, Jackson is currently operating under a state of emergency due to state the reason for the state of emergency. This unprecedented situation has brought about numerous challenges that affect our daily lives, our community, and our democratic processes. The city of Jackson is fully aware of the difficulties that have arisen and is taking comprehensive measures to address them. We understand that this situation has created challenges for everyone, and we want to assure you that the city is committed to ensuring a fair and accessible election. Despite the obstacles, our priority remains to uphold the integrity of the electoral process. We are working tirelessly to ensure that every eligible voter has the opportunity to cast their ballot without undue hardship or risk. The city is working to make sure that all polling locations are safe and accessible for all voters. This includes implementing enhanced safety protocols, such as regular sanitization of voting equipment, social distancing measures, and providing personal protective equipment to both voters and election workers. Additionally, we are ensuring that accessible voting options are available for individuals with disabilities so that everyone can participate in the election process. They are also providing updates on any changes or adjustments to the election process due to the state of emergency. These updates are being communicated through various channels, including public announcements, community meetings, and electronic bulletins. We encourage all residents to stay informed by regularly checking these updates. The city is also working closely with community leaders and organizations to disseminate information and provide support to those who may need assistance navigating the changes. By working together, we can ensure that our community remains resilient and that our democratic processes continue to function effectively, even in times of crisis. Section 7. Updates from the city staying informed, staying engaged. Speaking of updates, it's important to stay informed about any news or announcements from the city regarding the special election. The city will be providing regular updates through its website, social media channels, and local media outlets. These updates will include information about voter registration deadlines, polling locations, and any changes to election procedures. Stay connected, stay informed. Section 8 candidates and their platforms getting to know the contenders. Now, let's talk about the candidates. Several dedicated individuals have stepped up to run in this special election. Each candidate brings their own unique perspective and ideas to the table. It's important to take the time to learn about each candidate's platform, their experience, and what they hope to accomplish if elected. You can find information about the candidates on the city's website, as well as through local news coverage and candidate forums. Section 9, Community Engagement, Town Halls, Forums, and Making Your Voice Heard. One of the best ways to get to know the candidates and their positions on the issues is to attend community events like town halls and forums. These events provide an opportunity for you to hear directly from the candidates, ask questions, and share your concerns. Engaging in the political process at this level is vital for a healthy democracy. Section 10, the power of local elections, shaping the future of Ward 2. We often hear about national elections, but local elections like this special election in Ward 2 have a direct and immediate impact on our daily lives. The decisions made by the City Council affect everything from the condition of our streets and the quality of our schools to public safety and economic development. When you participate in local elections, you're making a real difference in your community. 
Section 11, your call to action, be a part of the change on election day. The Ward 2 special election is your opportunity to help shape the future of your community. Remember these important dates. Election day, insert election date here. Absentee voting, insert dates and times here. Make your voice heard, Jackson. Your vote is your power. That's all the time we have for tonight. Thank you for watching and please get out and vote.